15, 16, huh? Okay. Jeremiah, chapter 3, verse 12. Go and proclaim these words. Oh, can I have a <laughs> That's all right. Go and proclaim these words towards the north. All the way in North America? Okay, read that again. Go and proclaim these words towards the north. Go ahead. And say, return, thou backsliding Israel. And that's talking about you blacks and Latinos. Return unto the most high. You hard-headed Negroes, that's what he's saying. That's right. Okay. He said, return unto him. You so-called Negroes and Latinos. Okay? Because you are the true people of the Bible. You're Israel. That's right. You're Jacob. You're from the seed of Jacob. Go ahead. Yes, sir. Says the Lord. Says who? Says the Lord. Go ahead. And I will not cause my anger to fall upon you. Go ahead. For I am merciful. See, the most high is merciful, man. That's right. Okay? That's what you blacks and Latinos understand. He's merciful. That's right. Okay? We could still be in chains and wrapped around our necks in this place. Okay? Getting, still getting our backs whooped. Right? Says the Lord, and I will not keep anger forever. Verse 13, only acknowledge thy iniquity. And that's what you blacks and Latinos have to do, man. Acknowledge your iniquities and whatever your iniquities might be. That's if right. it's hell among them, drug dealing, okay? All these things. Sleeping with other men's wives. Whatever your sin that it might be, go ahead. That thou hast transgressed. Transgress. What transgression means what? Breaking the most high's laws. That's what it means. Transgressing against the Most High, yeah. against the Lord thy God, right. and has scattered thy ways to the strangers. And that's why a lot of you blacks and Latinos scattered your, your, your ways unto the strangers, man, unto the heathens or the Gentiles. Okay, yeah. under every green tree, and ye have not obeyed my voice. And you so-called Negroes and Latinos still ain't listening to the Most High. That's right. Okay. Because a lot of you still smoking weed, still being whoremongers, drug dealers, okay? But the most I got, got a reserve for a lot of you blacks and Latinos that's coming real s soon, right? Says the Lord. Verse 14. Turn, O backsliding children. Then he says it again. Damn, I hate Turn, that. Turn, O backsliding yeah, children of Israel. Damn weed, man. Oh, yeah. Right? Says the Lord, for I am married unto you. And a lot of you blacks and Latinos understand, man, we're, as a nation of people, man, we are married unto the Most High. That's right. Okay? We are married unto the Most High. And that's what a lot of a lot of you black women and Latino women don't understand. Once you marry your husband, you're supposed to deal with your husband that's and right. own your husband. That's right. Not four or five different men. That's right. Okay? We're going to bring those scriptures out too so you get a little bit of understanding of what we're talking about. Okay? Because you got nothing to do but draw around. Burning gas. Burning gas. That's how simple our people are, man. We're going to drive around for two hours and blast the music, man. I'm going to get out, man. What's up? And I will take you one of a city and two of a family. And I will bring you to Zion. See? That, that's how that's how cold the most high is, man. Okay? He killed, taking everybody. That's right. Go ahead, keep going. And I will give you pastors according to my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. And that's what we're doing. Feed you with knowledge and understanding of what? The Bible. That's right. Okay? On, man. From Genesis to Revelation. Come on, man. Yeah. Okay? Way down the street to that. That's what you blacks and not do understand. We come out every Saturday, man. Do what we're supposed to do now that we're woken up. That's you never right. See, you never okay. see something like that in the white neighborhood. Yeah. Nah. This is crazy. You got that? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Oh, we're destroyed. Ezekiel 3 and 17. <laughs> Son of man, I've made the watchman into the house of Israel. You looking at your watchman right now, you blacks and Latinos. That's right. Okay? You are your watchmen. And no, we didn't go to the so-called white man theologian school to learn this. Okay? This is all poured upon the most high who put that spirit on us to come out here and teach our people. That's right. Your transgressions, what you're doing against the most high. Oh, okay? Whatever you're smoking weed or being whoremongers or drug dealers, whatever it might be. Okay? Right? Therefore hear the word. It's like a therefore hear the word of my 
at my mouth and gives a warning from me. You, and that's what he's doing. We're giving you warning from the Most High. This is just a warning. Okay? Out of the scriptures. A lot of you blacks and Latinos want to say this is a so-called white man's book. Man, this ain't the so-called white man's book. It's you so-called Negroes and Latinos book. It's your historical record of who you are as a nation of people. That's right. You have laws, statutes, commandments. You have dietary laws. You have high holy days. Okay? Go ahead. Verse 18. When I say the wicked shall surely die, thou givest him not warning, nor seekest to warn him the Slack yet. Well, I'll start at the top. Verse 18. When I say unto you, the wicked shall surely die, and thou givest him no not warning, nor speakest to warn him the wicked from their wicked ways to save his life, that same wicked man shall die in his iniquity. And that's what we're doing. We want the blood to be off our hand. That's okay? Because right. we woke up, we know who we are, we are the nation of Israel. Okay? Now we give you so-called Negroes warning from the Most High. That's right! Okay? Now, the Most High said, if we don't warn you blacks and Latinos, the Most High is going to kill us. Okay? Now, we warning you, now the jump is going to be on you, and this, we're going to finish reading the scriptures. Go That's ahead. right! But his blood will I require at thine hand. What? Verse 19. Man, yet if thou warn the wicked, uh, and he turn not from his wicked ways, man, nor from his wicked Why, ways, man. he Why? shall, you look familiar, man. He shall die you, in his iniquity. Know that, brother. But I go to church over paradise, I'll be over uh, yeah, the temple sometimes. Okay. He shall die in his iniquity, uh, but thou hast we delivered I'm thy own yeah, soul. That's right. Part of the Brooks is so we yeah. delivered our yeah. soul, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's my uncle. That's what it's about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay. 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 We delivered ourselves, man. That's right. Okay. Say so Ezekiel 22 and 26. Give me Isaiah 58 and 1. Oh. Isaiah 58 and 1. You got it? Ezekiel 22 and 26. Her priests have violated the law. And this is what every st stupid pastor, this black church that's up in the ghettos, this is what they're not teaching our people. Okay? That's right. They're not teaching our people the law, statute, and commandments. Okay? Same thing in the, in the Latino community. Okay? Read that again. Ezekiel 22 and 26. Her priests have violated my law and have profaned my holy things. They have put no difference between thine, it's like they have put no difference between the holy and the profane. And that's what a lot of our so called pastors are not teaching our people between the holy and the uh, unholy. Teaching what's right and teaching what's wrong within the scriptures. Go ahead. Neither have they shown difference between the. So like it. Neither have they shown difference between the unclean and the clean, and have hid their eyes from my Sabbath. From the who? From my Sabbath. And a lot of you blacks and Latinos understand this is the Most High's day, man. That's which right. is the Sabbath day, which is from Friday, Saturday, uh, Friday sundown to Saturday sundown. Definitely okay. Is right. that 27? No, I'm from sure. And I am profane among them. Verse 27. Her princes in the midst, so like you heard, princes in the midst, therefore, are like wolves, ravishing the prey to shed blood and destroy the soul to go dishonest again. Right. And that's what a lot of those pastors do, man. Take take your hard-earned money that you're giving to these churches and teach you a damn thing about the Most High. That's right. They ain't teach you nothing. Okay? Huh. Not teach you about the dietary laws. Not teach you don't put tattoos on your body. Telling you grow your beard. Okay, that's the law. Okay? 